giving you an opportunity to get the full story from the people who tell it best. This is Mediacom News Leaders. And we're back with a very special holiday themed segment. My guest is wearing a Santa cap. That's how holiday it is. This uh -huh. is Melissa Bohan Webble. Hello. Hi, James. Thanks Welcome. for having me. Thank you. Welcome to News Leaders. Thank you. It's great to be here. First time, yeah. Yes. We've got a show called Home for the Holidays, which is coming up at the end of November. That's right. November 29th through December 2nd. And this sounds like a lot of fun. It is. We're really excited. It's going really well. We have a stellar cast. Um, it's just a short uh, show, about an hour and a half long. It's just a celebration of Christmas songs and a trip to Santa's workshop and a military family around Christmas time and then also uh, we, the celebration of the very first Christmas. And it's just great for all ages. We're very excited about it. It's um, just going to be a great show. Yeah, well, you're you're a great singer, Melissa. Thank you. You've got a great voice on you. So, how many songs do you think you'll be singing in this production? In this show? Well, hmm, I can't give it away exactly. Um, but we're featuring some other special guests singing this year. Um, uh, particularly, Mr. and Mrs. Claus are going to make an appearance. I booked them early, great. so that's Always good. Yeah. Good with that. I know they're very busy this time of year. You know, it's the strangest thing. Um, but yeah, so um, I am singing a little bit and doing a little dancing. But um, we are. Are featuring a lot of people from the community which is what I think is really cool about this show um, we brought in people from all the colleges universities the dance classes uh, the dance studios Whoa. and um, featuring one of my favorite um, a group called tapped in from dance arts those are my tapping ladies and they are doing a uh, a great tap number oh, choreographed. Dance arts. They oh, do yeah. the best work. I know, right? They're so good. Oh, I know. It's going to be fun. Yeah, so just wait for that number. It's choreographed by Hallie uh, Rainwater. Oh, yeah. And, you know, she's amazing too. So yeah. that's uh, that's one of the many highlights that are going to be in the show. So we're really, really excited. Let's back up just a bit. Okay. Was this your idea? Yes, it was. <laughs> It was. I am a Colombian, first of all. I grew up here um, performing at all the local um, community theaters like CEC and Maplewood Barn and then Arrow Rock Lyceum, you know, that does great stuff. And uh, so I went to school for musical theater. I moved to New York. I was on Broadway for a couple of years, then the, did a tour of Wicked for a little bit. My husband and I moved back. And um, I was lucky enough to get to direct for trips and Columbia College, and I just fell in love with it. Like, I think directing is my one of my favorite things. I love performing, but I really like directing, too. Yeah. And I've just always had this, you know, dream to do this holiday Christmas event, and Nolly Moore from Columbia College said, let's do it. <laughs> so... <laughs> I'm surprised someone else hasn't done this before. Right, Home I know. for the holidays right in Columbia. Right in Columbia. With, and with the talent of our area. Right, I agree. I think this, this area is so talented, just from, you know, production staff to artists of all kinds, singers. Um, and that's really what this is, is like pulling in the local artists and then also giving back to the community. All 10% of the ticket sales will go directly to City of Refuge this year, um, which that's that's our main goal is to use the community to give back to the community. And I just think it's just something that I would look forward to every year as a kid and as a family. Um, so that's just something. So this might be the first, not necessarily the last, right? I'm hoping. We are hoping. Yeah, we would love for this to be a... Uh, uh, an annual event. Um, and so since this was your idea, did uh -huh. you come up with all the songs and everything that's kind of going into it? Yes. I mean, I didn't them? write the Alleluia Chorus, but <laughs> <laughs> but yes, I, <laughs> I arranged, um, you know, the medleys, et cetera, and then wrote the script for it. In this, in this show, we take a trip to Santa's workshop, which is the big storyline uh, in, in this year's. But, um, you know, What's cool about using local talent is if you have a group in the community that is exceptionally gifted in this area, uh, when you're writing a show like this, I can say, hey, that would be great for this. Let's incorporate that into the show next year. Exactly. So I just think it's so exciting to see what the community has to offer and then display it. And, and yeah, just and the holidays, what a great time to do it. Right. So it's November 29th through December the 2nd, mm -hmm. Bonner Auditorium. Yes, that's correct. And the times are Thursday through Saturday at 7.30. Correct. Another matinee is Saturday at 2. Mm -hmm. And then Sunday at 3. Yes, that's right. Tickets. The tickets uh, are, are $10 for general admission. Three and under, if they sit on your lap, are free. We really want to encourage the whole family to come. We oh, don't want definitely. to break the budget. Um, we just want it to be a great event. And also that weekend, I believe, is the lighting. Thursday is the shelter insurance does the 
the lighting event downtown. Oh, perfect, huh? Yeah, so go to the lights, get some food, and come see the show at Lawner. For more information, visit the website homefortheholidays.me. Yes, correct. Or write to info at homefortheholidays.com. That's correct. All right, we got it all in, Melissa. All right. Thank, thank you, you so much. Good thank to you. see you again. Any other shows you got, come on by and see All me. All right, we'll do. All thank right. you so much. See you.